got you. Wow, that must be thrilling. After all you've done, I'm going to be the one that takes you down, Curtis. I think you're mistaken. It is, in fact, I who will be recognised as the one who took down the great Detective Valentine. Ending my career. Look around you, we're, we're cordoned off. There's no escape. I've got backup coming. You're unarmed. So how are you going to take down my career? Do you have any idea what we're standing in? Is that what I think it is? Alright. If you were to die right now, Detective, what would be the one thing you would want to do? It's up to me. I'd take down the person who killed ah, so many. But since you can't... Could be something to do with the cigarettes in your top pocket. May I? <laughs> See when it boil, all boils down to it, detective. It's the simple pleasures in life, like a final cigarette. Don't do anything stupid like last time, Kirby. Last time? I almost got killed robbing that place. The difference between you and I, Kurt, is I don't mind if I die taking you down. I'm ridding the world of your scum. That's <laughs> sappy. But you're wrong. Dead wrong. Because you do care. Because you have a little son. And he needs a father. Otherwise, he's going to turn out like me. And you know what? Me and you have one thing in common, Detective. I don't care if you die either. Why do you do this? Some would say that nothing turns more heads than a bank robbery. Others would recite about how it's all about the thrill of the chase. The world was started by a big bang after all. But me? No. No lies. He tells me exactly what I should do. You mean Kurt Cobain? You know him. Curtis. Don't He's... say it. Don't even think it. That man is dead. He faked it. Curtis. You don't understand. You're not allowed. He doesn't speak to you. Take it back. You fuck. You're more messed up than I thought you were. You're a freak. I gave you a chance, but now, it's time for you to burn. No, that's not how it happened. You must be mistaken.